to Madison County now. We have breaking news from Anderson High School at this hour. That's where police detained a student found at school with a gun after learning of a threat on social media. Karen Campbell joins us live from Anderson tonight. Karen, tell us what you know. Well, Superintendent Dr. Joe Kronk says the important thing here is that everyone is safe. I'm standing in front of Anderson High School. Now you can see, uh, well, there were police there in the parking lot because of this threat. They said uh, they will actually be here tomorrow as well. So the superintendent tells us that it all started this afternoon. Uh, with an Instagram post going around school stating there was a student with a gun. A student also reported seeing another student with a weapon. Now, after security cameras, after checking those cameras, school leaders found the suspected student with a loaded handgun. Now, they were able to disarm the student and call police. The school did go on lockdown that lasted through the end of the day, and the superintendent says safety is the utmost importance. Since school shootings became a, a sadly more frequent event is we run down every single lead that we get, every social media post, every rumor of a social media post. Parents send us the best that they have, and our job is to educate and to send them home safe. And that's what we do every single day. Now, Dr. Kronk tells us that schools have active shooter drills, random backpack checks, lockdown drills, and more. But again, uh, one student was taken into custody by Anderson police here after being found with a loaded gun. And Dr. Kronk also says the important thing today, he says, is that everyone did everything right and got to go home safe. Reporting live from Anderson, Karen Campbell, 13 News.